Hey, how you doing everybody? This is John and we're going to do another video review. It's going to be for the iHome alarm clock and it's going to be for the Bluetooth speaker with two USB charging ports for your cell phone recharge. So let's go ahead. Let's take a look at this clock. It's going to be for model number IBT 235. So if you take a look at the clock, it almost looks like an old school clock. Um, but the only difference is that you got a digital readout and this overall over here is going to be your speaker, which you can connect with your Bluetooth on your phone. So you can play music and listen to some great tunes. All right. So let's go ahead and let's take a look at the controls really quick. All right. This is a plug-in model, as you can see, it plugs into the wall. There is a battery. You do not have to buy any batteries uh, for this alarm clock. The batteries are built in, okay? As you can see, there is that screw that is right over there. Now, if you take a look at the manual, okay, uh, that is included with the package and the alarm clock, it will give you the disc description of the battery, all right? So you do have two alarms, okay, that you can set for two different times, okay? So say, for example, if you want to wake up on uh, just uh, for one settings for weekdays and then the other settings for weekends. You cannot set this phone for different days, um, but it does uh, have the ability to set for two different times. Also from the second button from the left is you can see your Bluetooth button, which you can pair it with your phone. And then you have your sleep timer, which is right over there. Now, when the alarm is activated, Okay, so we turn the phone, uh, clock around. You can hit the snooze button, which lasts about nine minutes. You have the controls over there, all right, which you have the plus or minus so when you're setting the time. And then you have your nighttime button, okay, which uh, illuminates the... Uh, which illuminates the uh, light a little more darker. So um, you also have your two charging points in, in the back. As you can see, when I press the nighttime, you can see that the lights in the back have uh, gone on. You see your two charging ports for your cell phone. So if you have two cell phones, which uh, I know a lot of people have a lot of cell phones. They have their own personal cell phone plus the one for work. So you can charge them on at the same time. Uh, the button on the far left is your daylight savings time. Uh, on a lot of the videos, as you can see from my YouTube channel, I do uh, the videos for alarm clocks. I do set the daylight savings time automatically. So I never have to set any of the clocks when the time changes. I do note that if you see this video, take a look at the date that this video was made. Um, there is a move uh, in Congress to uh, make uh, the time permanently with no daylight savings time. But I do set it just in case because if it never changes, then I don't have to worry about going back to set the clocks. Unless you have one of those clocks that you just hang up on the wall and you have to reset them manually. You have the button on the far right. Uh, that is the button that you use to set the time. You press the button and then you activate the plus or minus on the top. And that's pretty much basically about the clock. It is a nice clock. It does keep very well time. And you know, it does pretty much basically everything. With the little added extra feature of pairing it with your cell phone, with the Bluetooth, you listen to music. It's a great addition, okay? And, you know, it, it's pretty nice. It's a very well-made clock, very durable. And um, I don't see it breaking down anytime soon. I do have questions about the inner battery, how long it lasts, but I'm pretty sure it lasts a while. Also, if you go and refer to your manual, or you can see the manuals on my video YouTube channel for this clock, it might give you a description 
as to how long the battery will last. Um, and if you do buy this clock, you could probably write and get an extra battery and then change it out. And that's pretty basically it about my review for the iHome model number IBT 235, the power clock Bluetooth speaker with two USB charging ports. I hope you enjoyed this quick video. I know it was a little bit long and that's pretty much basically about it. Be sure to check out the rest of my other videos on my YouTube channel and you guys have a great day.